Hi, I'm Dar with the Healy Technology Report, and today we're going to be unboxing a Ubiquiti M900 Loco. So this is this is the unit here, uh, and this is very similar to the uh, nano stations you get in the 2.4 range or the 5 gigahertz range. But when you ask why would you need something like this? Now, what it comes down to is is 5 gigahertz is the most common. There's a lot less interference. The bandwidth uh, for the 5 uh, gigahertz range is a lot more engineered. Uh, and so that's the best one to go. But if you've got a five gigahertz antenna and then you find you got, you know, you got trees or it's not perfectly line of sight or there's some other things, then the lower frequency that you go down to, it has a better ability to go through trees and leaves and different things like that. Now, if you got concrete walls and, uh, and buildings and things in the way, forget it. Uh, but if you're looking for an improvement for trees for five gigahertz, this is the product to, to look at. So let's jump in and see what's inside the box. Okay, so one of the things you notice first is this box is blue with the twos and the fives. Uh, the boxes are black. Now, I happen to see a, a three gigahertz antenna, which is a... Uh, a license band, so there's a lot less interference in the in the three, and the and the uh, box for that is oddly enough green. So here we've got a quick start guide, and uh, it looks like it's a common one for a Pico and uh, some of the other nano stations. So nothing out of uh, place there. Let's put that down. Now here is the actual M900, and we're going to have a closer look at this after it uh, comes out of the box so uh, we'll come back to that we've also got the uh, PoE injector and of course as normal PoE in LAN so where it says PoE that goes onto the antenna now make sure you get these right because if you don't you're gonna damage your other networking equipment so PoE always has to go to the antenna LAN goes to your other networking equipment so there's uh, the jack on the back uh, this is a 24 volt 0.5 amp uh, adapter from Ubiquity. We've got the power cord, of course, and we have two straps to attach uh, the unit to a pole. Now, of course, also on the box, uh, we have well, we have a serial number there. It looks, that's that's most likely the MAC address, so it looks different than uh, uh, most MAC addresses I've seen. Okay, and then the instructions of the box. Let's have a look at this unit here. Uh, so we've got a power, uh, signal strength, and then uh, connectivity for the LAN. Uh, there's our, our pole mounts with the holes on the side that you can put the, the straps in. And uh, like the other nanos, so underneath there we have a reset button, a single LAN jack, and then uh, RPSMA. Now, honestly, I, I don't know what that uh, means. It uh, warrants some more investigation because the other nanos don't have uh, an antenna jack uh, like that. Okay, I'm uh, Dar with the Helia Technology Report. Find this product on our website at www.buyphonesonline.ca. Uh, also, please uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, we'd love to show you some more of these, uh, these great products. Bye for now.